Don't ignore urination, but respond to it. And this is our habit number seven. Okay? We discuss uh, in our habit number six about what? Developing a positive attitude. And we found out that it is also good for your health. Okay? If you don't know about it, for beginners and for new viewers and followers of these habits, Okay, formation, then visit my Dr. Lahot TV. Now, this is Dr. Darwin Suniega Lahot. We will be talking today about habit number seven, and this is about what? Ignoring your urination. Okay, the moment that there is signal, okay, sometimes we ignore. When we are busy, when we are doing Facebook Live, or shall we say, we are doing something that is, we know that is very important. But the moment that our urination, okay, is, is signaling and sometimes we ignore it. And there is danger when we ignore about it, okay? There is a problem that sometimes or there is a problem that will happen. There is a disorder or physiological disorder, okay? Because urine okay, will signal you when the urinary bladder is already what, at the level of uh, releasing the urine. The level of 150 ml, and it goes up to 200 to 500, and your urinary bladder can hold up to one liter okay one liter that's why you you hold it okay even you are in the highway you can hold it until one liter but it's not good right even if you can hold it it's not good okay when you ignore it this will happen number one is uh, the pH level will go down okay that, that's why um, most urinalysis there is a ps level where you can see and will check your doctor will check it okay that your ps level is telling you about your urine okay and that is a problem also when your ps level go down from seven six five and when you reach to five most people okay most people are having this problem when their pH level in the urine reaches to what below six, okay, most people who have problem they have this pH level five or five point five or below five, six, okay. Then second is this sedimentation. When your pH level okay starts to be acidic, then there is sedimentation. Maybe your urine starts to solidify in the lining of your urinary tract okay and the sedimentation will happen you know what is sedimentation okay i have a publication in the online wiley or in the microsoft um scholar or google scholar you can find it the lahot's nutritional sedimentation okay lahot's theory of nutritional sedimentation this is about sedimentation okay and the danger of sedimentation. Okay, know about it. No sedimentation. It will give you problem later on. Okay, from acidity to sedimentation, then inflammations or infections. Okay, because when there is sedimentation or the acidity, okay, in your urinary bladder down to the urinary tract, okay, it will injure some of the tissues linings and nerves and that's why when there is inflammation there is infection okay there is infection now last is what the nitrogen when nitrogen urea nitrogen okay goes up in your blood then there is danger okay when your doctor see that there is high level of nitrogen in your blood then there is problem in your kidney Okay, maybe your kidney is not well functioning. And another risk is when people have this heart problem, heart attack, or cardiovascular problem. So when you ignore urination, 
okay? You develop this acid, okay? Acid, acidity, okay? Sedimentation, inflammation or infection. Then what? This level of nitrogen will go up. So I advise you, my friend, to if you feel that you are ignoring for many years or many months already, then visit your doctor, okay? And your doctor knows what to do about you. Maybe he or she will get your urinalysis, okay? And to check your urine and to check your health. So do not ignore what? Urination, but instead respond to it. The moment you feel that uh, you are what? Urinating or you can feel that there is a signal go immediately to CR of your if you are traveling if you are traveling and you are not commuting you can stop or even if you're commuting you can ask the, the, the driver or the conductor to hey mr. driver okay can I okay so please manage it you know and make it a habit to obey the signal to listen your body because your body has signal okay a signal molecules telling your brain okay we need to unload this thing okay when you don't listen to your body then your body will be what destroyed before when you ignore it uh, they will be like um, someone who is you mostly ignore that uh, they will feel what depressed they will feel lazy or they become lazy until what they will not make signal anymore when they do that then there is risk your health so that's not habit number seven and uh, habit number eight will follow next if you follow this what this program and please share if you care this is dr Robin Sunyegalal assalamualaikum alhamdulillah